What's good, YouTube? Today we're gonna try a little different uh, look on the deck profiles. If you notice, the cards below me are actually going to change. So I'm going to start with Jake Bonner's Cyber Dragon Regional Report. He actually topped the regional that uh, the Dark Lord Duelist did over in Australia and gave me a week's advance notice that, hey, I will need to keep my deck secret for the LLDS Stage 2, which he actually got second in. So uh, this is actually kind of a double profile, but this is the Perth Regionals. And uh, I got that heads up that, hey, you know, uh, it's going to be weak. So if you ever give me a heads up, I will profile your uh, deck list later than sooner in a week. So let's get into this. Three Cyber Dragon, three Cyber Dragon Dre, three Cyber Dragon Core, triple Galaxy Soldier, double Maxi, and Honest. One Electromagnetic Turtle, double uh, the Star Destroying Kaiju, he is a machine. Uh, one Thunder King Kaiju, one Gamma Seal. Triple Overload Fusion, triple Machine Dupe, triple Pot of Desires, Triple Cyber Repair Plant, Triple uh, Interrupted Kaiju Slumber, Double Power Bond, Double Twin Twisters, Double Instant Fusion, One Regeki, One Foolish Burial, and One Cosmic Cyclone. Double Cyber Dragon Infinity, Double Cyber Dragon Nova, One uh, or Two Constellar Pilates, doing them Pilates, One Number 38 Hope Harbinger Dragon, one Panzer Dragon, a Pear Psychroid, another uh, Instant Fusion target here, I suppose. That's a machine. One Cyber End Dragon, double Chimera Tech Fortress Dragon, double Chimera Tech Rampage Dragon, and uh, one Chimera Tech Over Dragon. Kind of curious as to why he chose this over another Panzer. Uh, triple Flying Seed, triple Danko Rekka, triple Anti -fragr uh, Spell Fragrance, triple Dimensional Barrier. One Ghost Ogre and Snow Rabbit, one Alley of Justice Cycle Reader, and the last on this. Uh, outside of uh, these Dimensional Barriers and uh, Anti-Spells, this entire build is pretty budget. Uh, and I guess the Danko Sekas and Galaxies. Um, but, you know, the main deck having $60, $70, $80, uh, 90 something 100 110 and 110 is pretty cheap for Yu-Gi-Oh! 125 125 main deck, um, these are only sixes, not bad, you know, uh, you could probably build something similar and try it out on your own, and let's get into that tournament report, uh, regionals, uh, <clears throat> I faced Dark Synchro in one, I beat Blue Eyes, Nathan Kosk in one, uh, Hero Toad lost, lost to Dark Bribe on Slumber, Minerva I won, Chainburn I won, ABC I won against, BAPK Ophion uh, I took the loss on. So uh, going uh, X2 but getting in that 8th slot. And the LLDS Stage 2, one against Tree Toad Hero, one against Cyframe, one against ABC, then lost to Mermels. Shoutouts to Team CDI, me, Chris, Boylan, uh, Phil... I don't want to murder this man. It's P-E-K-K-A-R. Picar, I think. Phil Picar. And shout out to Harry Lockley beating me 4th round LLDS and 7th round regionals. So, uh, I guess the same guy got him twice. Uh, it's unfortunate. So, I guess the Mermel matchup's not super ideal for this deck with Totally Awesome now. But, that's our, uh... Our Cyber Dragon deck from Jake Bonner. And uh, tell me how you feel about the new uh, side thing. Do you like it? Do you dislike it? Uh, just something I thought of. And I may have somebody helping me out with uh, layouts for this square screen soon. So uh, may may have a little bit of a better look at deck list if you enjoy this. Uh, I can move this like this and have this over here. And uh, like this, but I think it's better placed in this Twitch chat box. Um, or I can like do this and do that. But again, I, I just think it's better the way I did it. But let me know, you guys, which one do you prefer? Uh, is the card easier over here to watch? Uh, or under me in my face? You know, dragging you guys over to look at me, even though I just woke up. Thanks for watching, guys.